we will be discussing order types in MetaTrader 4. The first and most important order type that you will most frequently use is a market order. And I will show you two ways how to enter a market order into your platform. Along with the market order, for each order you should have two exits. I will also show you how to place a take profit and a stop loss order as well to go along with your market order. There are other types of orders as well which are considered pending orders and those are called limit orders and stop orders. We will not be going over those today. I just want to focus on the market orders, your take profit and your stop loss because those are the going to be the ones that we use most often. So here we are looking at the Euro USD 15 minute chart. I have not plotted out any technical analysis because I want you to fully be able to see what the market is doing and the lines that actually populate on the chart uh, once I place the orders for you to be able to recognize them. So we have two different ways to enter an order in MetaTrader 4. One is what I call the long way and that's the traditional way of entering, entering an order. And the other is the one-click trading, which is obviously the most favorite because it's quick. You're able to get in the market, make your adjustments, and um, within a couple of seconds versus the other way, it takes a little time to actually enter the order into the market. But I will show you both of them, and you can decide which one you like better. So we're going to go to the top of the toolbar and enter new order. You will get a pop-up screen, which is the order box. In this particular case, um, let's just assume that the market isn't in consolidation, although it is on this 15-minute chart, and I want to enter a buy order. If I'm entering a buy order, here it says that the price I'm entering in at is 1.0670. My take profit. I want to set it 10 pips above 1.0670, so I will set my take profit at 10680. And you can scroll up and down on the actual chart, or you can simply enter it into uh, manually. My take profit I have set at 1.0680, which is 10 pips above the buy price. And I will go ahead and set my stop loss 10 pips below the buy price. So we will set that at 10660. And it is that simple. I have my market execution here listed. My volume currently is at 0 0.10, which is equivalent to $1 per pip. And I would click Buy Market. And there you see I am immediately in the market with both my take profit and my stop loss set simultaneously. That is what I call the long way of entering the market because it does take a few minutes um, to actually get in depending on where you're setting your stop loss and take profit. The other way of entering the market is with one stop trading and I will use this bear chart here, or one-click trading, excuse me. So with one-click trading, you would right-click on the chart, open up the one-click trading application that's within the chart, and you are going to be entered into the trade much quicker. This here is a 15-minute chart of the Australian dollar versus the U.S. dollar. And same thing applies if I wanted to get into a buy trade, I would simply click on the buy option. My buy position is immediately opened. You always want to have a stop loss and take profit order set for each and every trade that you get into. There's obviously some movement in the market right now. So I will click on my entry order right click on it and scroll my take profit level up. And in this case, we'll just go ahead and put it at five pips or six pips. Again, I'm trading at $1 per pip. 
So on the left-hand side, you can see that it says $6 USD, which would be my profit, and 60 pips. The pips actually show the pip -ep, which is included. So it's not 60 pips that I am up. It's just 6.0, but the decimal point is not in there. So please keep that in mind if you are using this method, as it can be a little bit confusing starting out. So I've set my take profit. I also want to set my stop loss, and I will do the same thing. I will right click on my entry order of the buy and then drag my stop loss level down. And I will drag my stop loss level down to six pips also so that I can have an even one to one ratio. And as you can see here, I'm now in the trade as well with both my take profit and stop loss placed. So those are the two quickest ways to get in and out of a trade. Um, obviously the take profit and the stop loss being set, it is either going to take me out of the trade in profit or stop loss, whichever one, since I'm going into the trade already knowing what my potential risk is. In this case, it is six pips on each of my trades. So now I will just sit here and let them play out. That there is how you open a trade in MetaTrader 4 using both the traditional order box method as well as the one-click trading method in MetaTrader 4. Have a great day. See you soon.